Welcome friends of the Crawford to the Victorian sunken garden of the Montanotti Hotel and we're delighted to be here again this is the second year for us but the third year for this sculptural exhibition um, that's taking place for the month of September so up until about the 27th and it's fantastic to see some returned sculptures and some new sculptures again this year. So we want to bring you over here to one of the one of the pieces in the garden here. So follow over this way and we'll have a look. So this is a wonderful bronze sculpture by Michael du uh, Mike Dewan and it's called Garden Angel. And I was delighted to be able to meet Mike and to meet um, Ken Folan from the Kildare Gallery on Culture Night because they were here giving guided tours through the garden and um, it was fantastic because Ken was filling me in that this mirror was an idea of the actual Montanotti themselves and wasn't part of the original um, idea for the sculptural exhibition but it means that you can simultaneously see all angles of the um, sculpture that we're looking at here today and we can even probably get a little glimpse of Neof, the Neo Finn on camera um, as well so it really brings all elements of the work and that's what the um, sculptor himself was telling me that it was fantastic that it brings all elements of view and in fact the viewer is also part of the artwork by using a mirror in the background. And Mike has a few other pieces that we're going to show you here as well. And um, we're going to have a look at a few of Neve's favourites and my returned favourite of Donica Cahill. So come along and we'll have a look. So friends, this is the balancing by Mike June and again it's another bronze sculpture and what he was saying when we were chatting with him on Culture Evening is that um, some people have come, looked around this work and they've compared the figure here on the bottom to Mother Earth herself with Adam and Eve balancing precariously up in the air and he's used Adam and Eve through another few of his sculptures here as well so that theme continued on through in and even in what people's perceptions of this work is. I'm standing here alongside a very appropriately named work it's called The Gossip and it's by Stephanie Hess and it's bronze edition and as Neve said it's, it's her favourite because she said the, 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 just the whole motion between the little bird whispering into the ear of the fawn and I'm not sure if you can get it on camera here but the colours are absolutely exquisite so the bronze coming through with the purples and the rings of a, of a paler blue colour coming through. I was tickle pink when I saw this one. This was what Ken Folan pointed out to me. Um, so it's um, a sculptural gong by Michael Foley called Awakening and it's from 2021 and it's bronze and stainless steel. But it was the sound, the whale sound that it makes when you stroke down the front of it. So I'm sure if you'll catch this on, ca on, on, on audio. beautiful sounds of whale song and I suppose we, we, we couldn't part from it without giving the old centrepiece it's its proper So friends we've had a wonderful trip around the Victorian sunken gardens and really well worth the visit do try and come in it's a beautiful safe space there's a lovely mezzanine area um, which is open air where you can get your coffee and everything afterwards and it's fantastic it's the third year in the in a in a row that um, the Kildare Gallery so Ken and um, Ruth Little have come and chosen this venue in Cork to to set the scene for the sculptures and for this fantastic exhibition. They've also exhibited in Bloom and in the Kildare Outlet. 
village and we will put on the catalogue so you can have a look for yourself and see as we've all moved into our gardens making more of the artwork now in the gardens has become a big thing so friends we hope you enjoy our little trip around the garden here today and do pop up for yourselves to have a look there is another exhibition the artist in residence inside and we'll take a few images and show them on to you is uh, d peters and he is a self-taught artist painter uh, everyday objects and we'll show you a few of those still lifes later but we were made very welcome here today by Ray from the Head of Marketing at Montanotti and a big thank you to Mike June and to um, Ken Folan for their time on that wonderful trip on Culture Evening. <laughs>